What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, John here from Puma Plow. We're back playing some more Farming Simulator 22. We're back, of course, on Green Valley, Nebraska. Let's get to it. All right, so the first thing on the agenda today, uh, actually last night, we'll back it up a little bit here. Uh, I stayed in, Troy stayed in for a little bit, and then I stayed in uh, longer last night and got all the plowing done. And on field, uh, what's it called, 20 as well. So all the plowing's done. We're good there. And uh, so today is going to be seeding. We're going to seed first thing. Oh. Game Nut, how are you doing today? Welcome in. Uh, so the first thing we need to do is actually we're going to buy a seeder. Assuming we can buy it. I don't actually know. Oh, look at us. Look at this chat. Oh, boy. Oh, oh I've never seen that one. The dual wheels. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> uh, as I said, I added some mods, so... Uh, Mr. Plugger hooked me up with some mods. Game Nut, I'm doing, I'm doing well. A uh, little late this morning because I was kind of... I slept in. I won't even lie. I slept in today and I should not have, but I did. But that's okay. Hi, Carson. How's it going? Um, oh, he made it cheaper too, didn't he? Yeah, I know, Carson. I'm never late. I know. I know, I know, I know. All right, so we're going to buy that. We're going to buy it. Sorry, Carson. We're going to buy the cart. Cart as well. And then we're going to go find our tractor. Because we need tractor with power. Pokemon, I choose you. Just saying. I choose you. Alright, Patches, thanks for the lurk. I appreciate you being here. Uh, for the support. I do. I appreciate it, man. Have fun working. Wait, what is that? Uh, what is that, Carson? That is sound alerts. That's sound alerts. Is sound alerts broken? Sound alerts must be broken. I tried to refresh it a couple times. I would say it's broken. Yeah. Yeah, that's what that is. I just turned it off. I don't know. Let to tell you on that one, Carson. Trooper, I am going to be seeding first thing. Seeding some wheat. That's what I'm doing. Yes. Plugger sent me uh, quite a healthy... He sent me 30... 30 something mods last night. So. Our client, what's up? How you doing? Mr. Burt, good afternoon, sir. It says I'm offline on sound alerts. Okay. I don't know what to tell you. I'll just leave it. Uh, yeah, so F. Um, pretty much. I'll just leave it turned off. Uh, yeah, so Plugger sent me 30-something uh, mods, and as of right now, not all of them are posted on Papa's website. However, that is something that is going to be accomplished over the next couple weeks or so. So, you guys are curious about any of the mods, you can check Papa's website, exclamation point smurf in the chat. Um, any of the mods that I'm messing with, like this tractor, or actually this Borgo Cedar is also... Pluggers. Plugger took the Borgo Cedar. He said he fixed it, so I don't know what that means. Uh, I know he upped the capacity on it, so I'm probably about to go be broke buying fertilizer and seed, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, beyond that, I don't know. And actually, he was telling me last night, he came in TeamSpeak for a while. Uh, Zether, what's going on, man? How you doing today? Uh, but he was telling me last night 
at this here fat tractor i think he said it has like 350 downloads off papa's website which is pretty awesome uh so they were they were surprised at the interest um that they were they were very surprised in the interest in, in this uh tractor so Greg, am I stealing it? No. Mine. It's mine. I bought it. Why? What? I'm not a criminal. Don't accuse me. Kyle Whitty, what's going on? How you doing? Not a criminal. Maybe. Oh, it still tracks off to the right. I think what he meant by when he said he fixed it, he uh, upped the capacity. So I'm actually going to drive this thing right to the bulk supply and just fill it there. I'm not even going to drive home because we don't have any solid, uh, we don't have any solid fertilizer at our homestead. So I'm going right to the bulk sales. Yes, we did have to buy a propane trailer and it is under trailers. This one is not on Papa's website, by the way. I don't know where Trent got this. This is the trailer we own for propane. Uh, the issue with it is the front legs just act like they're not there about 90% of the time and they just fall on the map. So, but yes, you do have to have a propane trailer and you do have to haul propane. Mm -hmm. Sean Sinclair, what's up, bud? How are you doing today, Sean? Welcome in. So yeah, we're just going to run down to the old, uh, bulk supply down here real fast and, um, Fill up with some seed and fertilizer and we'll be on our way. Now, I will tell you guys, as we are looking or as I'm on these long passes here in a few minutes, I will actually go in the mods and show you guys some of the stuff that I added last night. Actually, I added it this morning, like literally right before stream. Uh, but the, some of the stuff Plugger sent me is really, really cool. And uh, I'm very excited to, uh, to mess with it, you know? I don't think we want to take the toolbar actually in there. Go ahead and unhook it uh, out here on the in the, in the grass. But yeah, very very cool stuff. I can't wait, especially one mod for doing silage or chaffing. Can't wait for that. I really really can't wait to mess with that. I gotta lie. All right. Where do we buy seed and fertilizer in here? I don't actually know where we buy it. I know where we buy liquid, fertilizer, herbicide, propane, and what's it called? I don't know about seed and fertilizer. Did you say nice to you? Oh, hey. All right, thanks for ordering. Appreciate it. Um. Where do we buy? Where do we buy it? Where do we buy seed and fertilizer? Hmm, that's probably up that way behind me because this is a cell point here. This is a cell point. We gotta figure this out, chat. <laughs> Go ahead, Bert. Go ahead. All right. Is this it? Is this his herbicide? What this is? This would be it. But the problem is, I don't know if I can get the cedar in here and get back out of here with it. Gotcha, Sean. Um. Probably just gonna go drive this back to the homestead. Carson, we talked about it, bro. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this to the homestead. I'll bring a semi out here and grab some fertilizer. Cause it tells me this is just not gonna work like I wanted it to. And I'm not about to try to get stuck in a building. So I don't wanna do that. Oh, I'm not that much of a noob. We did, Carson. We legitimately did. We talked about it. Uh, the other night with the, the bucket hat. Remember, you are like, oh, they have bucket hats. Oh, the sticker finally shit or went through. And I was like, yeah, I know. 
I like saw it a couple days ago. Remember? You not remember this conversation? You probably don't. You've probably slept since then. You like graduated since then, you know? All right. Let's talk. Cleaning a tractor is harder than a car sand camp. Oh, nice, Carson. Very nice. All right, never mind on my idea of coming here to bulk supply to, you know, fill up. I ain't gonna work. I ain't gonna work there, Bobby. Cause it ain't got no gas in it. Or something like that. Something like that. Yeah, definitely. But that's okay. We'll run, uh, we'll bring semi down here and uh, grab a load of seed. Actually, no, not seed. Well, maybe seed, but fertilizer for sure. Fertilizer for sure. Maybe we'll have to get a different um, trailer for the semi as well. We might have one that has a little more capacity now. And when I say a little more, I mean just a smidge. Uh, just a, just a whole lot. Now, the cool thing is... The way Plugger did his mods for, for 22, or is doing his mods for 22, you have a trailer, it starts with the base capacity. And then you decide when you buy it, or of course you can customize it later, how much capacity do you want it to have? I think is really, really a cool way to do it, personally. Do it the fast way. Uh, Trent, what's up? You're actually in TeamSpeak, Trent? You're not out farming right now? What? What? Hi, Trent. Hi. No Do what? Oh, that's later. That's later. Oh. you a little, little afternoon farmer today? Yeah. All right. Whatever gets the job done, right? I had to go get a trailer today so I can come on my uncle's yard later. Oh. Gotcha. That window up peak kind of screwed with my sound. Sean, that sounds awful, yeah. Uh, thanks for that follow, appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going? Yeah. <laughs> Bert says he'll trade you. I'm wondering how this cedar is going to fill up here in this homestead, by the way, Trent. Or go. Uh, I I don't usually fill it in the homestead. <laughs> what do you fill it right out of a truck? Yeah, I fill it with the truck. I think that's probably the strategy. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, dude, audio and updates always breaking. Right? Yes. Carson, you're not wrong. Not wrong at all. Wait, how do you turn Team Speak Lady back down? I forgot. <laughs> a little loud. Just uh, team speak in general. This is loud this time. I had to turn it down. Oh no. Farm propane trailer wants to fall on the ground again. There we go. Got it. Alright. Yeah, Windows updates breaks audio like constantly from well, this is the first time it's done it on the TeamSpeak side for me. Oh. Uh, Sean, I, I, I guess. All right, Chad, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know where the heck my trailer is. I, I don't have a clue. Looking for a semi trailer. Let me know if you guys see it, Chad. I don't know where it is. It's gotta go around and open all the doors. What about the pig building? I don't know. No, oh, there it is. Okay. Part of the combine used to be part of the You know, on the combine. All right. Yeah. So in the uh, the release they put out today, uh, talking about the Kubota DLC, which can can I get like half my money back for the season pass? Is that a thing? The only thing I'm somewhat excited about the Kubota is the M8. That's it. Okay. What's up? 
a medium size tractor. Oh, okay. That actually has an American triangle and hazard lights. That's it. I got so. Oh, wow, Carson. Uh, I see they made Puma Plot bucket hats. They're available now in the merch store chat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great, Carson. That is great. Twenty two is coming to Game Pass tomorrow, really, Sean? That's good to know. There'll be a lot of people's questions probably. Yeah. Um yeah, so I actually, track. Oh yeah. Let's look at this. I need to honestly I want an end dump trailer because like I have to fill that cedar with uh, a belly dump trailer. Oh thank you. Oh thank you. You think they'll have a BX I don't think they'll have a BX twenty three eighty. I mean they got the loader that's on my Kubota. Oh really? Not the tractor, but they have the uh at least the loader part. Yeah, so allegedly, not allegedly, but if you look at the thing, like it shows two people in that side by side. So I'm wondering if they're going to have um, a buddy seat. Yeah, it sounds like they'll have that. Hey, this wouldn't be a bad trailer. Kind of looks cool. It's an end dumper. This is from Plugger. It holds, oh, it holds up to. Bugger. I'm not going to 5 million chat. I can't do that. Okay. I can't, I can't do, I can't do 5 million right off the jump, you know? So it's either 5 mil or 50,000. No, there's, there's other stages oh. in there. <laughs> I was going to yeah. say, there's like one extreme to the next. We'll go 100K. All right. $30,000 trailer. Okay. So I'm going to go sell the trailer that we have and put that one on instead. Because, um, yes, please. An end dump trailer would be very nice for. Yeah, what we're doing here. Uh, Trent, where do I buy, like, liquid, or not liquid, solid fertilizer and, uh, Full seed? Supply. Is that inside that building as well? Yeah, you just have to drive in it. Okay, that's I thought. Your seed, fur, and lime should be in that building at the little elevator station. Okay. Yeah, that's. I was looking at. I was trying to drive the Borgo right in there, but it's just too big. Not gonna work. I'll say those super bees. Like, I can get those super bees in there. Those Joker legacy ones. Sand camp. Where do you look for what? Are you talking about the the farm sim stuff? At posted a bunch of it in Discord. Their website. Uh, their Instagram. There's a bunch of places to find the information. Matt posted pretty much all of it in uh, Discord, so yeah. Oh yeah, it says right there the feature for multiplayer farming functional passenger seats. Yeah, but I wonder is that everything or is that just the Kubota DLC? You know? Yeah. Oh, it'll be in everything. I don't know. I just, to me, made money by switching trailers, I think. Uh, to me, it's just I not. I have it. a wet sock now, by the way. No. L3FT 43 <laughs> inch ear decks 100. I'm coming through Trent's state. Listen for the air in St. Louis soonish. Left, I should have actually told you what exit to honk your horn at so I could actually hear you. Remind me, I'm Team Six sometime left, I'll tell you. Uh, laugh thanks to the uh, the bits. Appreciate him, bro. Could whisper it to him. I could, but that would require me to uh, like grab a keyboard. That would require a lot of work, for me, you know. Carson underscore Phillips cheered X100. With the Kubota pack comes another neat feature, most interesting for multiplayer farming: functional kitten seats. Not just for the above mentioned UTVs by Kubota. But for all UTVs, cars, and trucks. Functional kitten seats? <laughs> it doesn't like passenger? 
Oh, it doesn't. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah. I had to look into that too. Uh, I was like, kitten. Car's sitting and left. Thanks for the bits. And uh, good afternoon, Mr. Plugger. How's it going, sir? I got a plugger trailer. Not overly. Okay, it's kind of big. 100,000. I swear I'm going to seed one of these days, Chad, okay? I swear I'm going to seed one of these days, but I just logistically got to get set up, you know? That's all. That is all. I hope this trailer pulls the, or this truck pulls this trailer. That's the, the thing I'm worried about. That's the thing I'm worried about right now. As soon as I can, Black Hat. Hi, by the way. Hello. I need solid fertilizer and seed. That's what I need right now. I'm working on it. Okay, for a second I thought I went down the wrong road. I'm like, uh-oh. Uh oh, idios. And that inmate's gonna be a nice uh, paddle or utility track. Yeah, right, Sean? Now, buddy seat for brakes makes a lot of sense, actually. I've always said, like, yeah, just jump in with somebody else and let them drive me around while I'm uh, while I'm taking a break. I think break it's a great idea. Food break. Yeah, it's a great idea. But. I don't know if it's if that's the thing that we're excited about out of the DLC. I think that's kind of sad. You know what I'm saying? I think that's kind of uh, kind of sad to be completely honest. If we're all like, man, buddy seat, yeah, it's like, yay. I'm gonna go broke filling this trailer up. Carson, I do too, honestly. I kind of do too. Mystery Tickers just resubscribed for four months. Yeet. Yeet. Uh, thanks for triggering the hype well. train, by the way. Woo, woo. Woo, woo. Oh, goodness. Thank you so much for the resub. How is it going? Welcome back for four months. Mr. Yidikis, thank you so much for the resub. How's it going, man? Yeah, honestly, Carson, I don't really know if I would buy season two at this point. Yeah. Yeah, I think that, I don't know. I don't want to trash them, but like, honestly, I think the DLCs have been really weak so far. Thanks, 80k seed and 100k for, okay, thank you, Plugger. So if I fill this trailer, I'll have a little extra to put put in storage, which is fine. I put it at a hundred thousand. This uh, trailer. I wonder so. if we can refund a uh, season pass on Steam. <laughs> I doubt it. No, no, you can't. It's been too too far. Anyway, I would assume. <laughs> I don't know. I just. I don't know. I'm sure somebody's really excited for a cut mode. About a DLC. It's just not me. I was about the season two later. Yeah. I kind of feel bad in a way um, that I. We all bought it. Well, I kind of advocated for people to buy the season pass. I kind of encouraged people to buy the season pass, and now I kind of feel bad. That, like, I did that yeah, after seeing what the first, like, two DLCs are, you know? Like, well, I kind of... Also, it's on sale. Is it? Yeah, it's, instead of twelve ninety nine, it's eleven ninety nine. so oh. it's, like, a, a buck cheaper, but... <laughs> Jim Bob, you're, you're excited? At least somebody is. <laughs> At least somebody is. There's only one thing out of that thing I'll actually use. I won't use any of it, honestly. And we'll turn it. We'll, since all of us pretty well have the season pass, I'm sure yeah. it'll get put on the server, and I'm sure we'll at least look at it. Kind of like we did with the uh, Anthony Guerrero or whatever, you know, the Tiny Tractor DLC. Yeah, Sean, the third and fourth DLC better, like, really, really, really um, be good DLCs, because right now... It's just, it's just not it, Chief, you know? I mean, we're supposed to be getting that conveyor bin pack. 
Yeah, but that sounds like a free content update. Which, don't get me wrong, the free content updates have actually been better than the DLCs. I mean, you're not wrong. You know, we got the case, uh, um, Road, Road Track. track. That was a content update. Uh, we, Pod track. Yeah. We got that uh, Chrome trailer that I use a ton of. Love that Chrome trailer if you're playing like base game. It's a great trailer. Uh, you know, the free content stuff's almost been better than there has been better than the DLC so far. So, I don't know. Yeah, the fourth is going to be the experience with the new map. Yeah, Sean. But. I don't know. Like I said, I don't want to sit here and trash them because, like, we haven't actually seen it yet. Big T underscore Tom just resubscribed for 41 months. 41 months, and how is the new map? Tom, thank you so much for the 41 month resub, first and foremost, at tier three. Appreciate you, dude. I uh, hope you're well. I haven't talked to Tom in a minute. Uh, new map is awesome. It's it's big. Um, it's It's big. I've not played a 4X since, uh, what did we decide it was the other day? Since I played the Michigan, Michigan on 19, which has been a while. Uh, so it, it's, it's taken me a little time to get used to like the bit of a height to haul grain or to do anything. So it's real, but it's fun so far. It's been good. And, uh, I have dry corn, so. Yeah, Michigan, and then right before that was uh, Madison County. Played that, like, kind of almost at the same time. Oh, yeah. Yep. But, no, it's uh, it's good. It's 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 good. I've, I've been enjoying it. How are you, uh, Tom? How's it going, man? It's been fun. Jeff, yeah. not wrong. Ballert, what's up? I have to sneeze chat, but like I can't sneeze, you know? It's like right there and it hurts, but I like it. It's not happening. No, oh, not happening. Okay. Not having it. I wonder if that's when they're going to be doing the, the patch, the new update. Yeah, because when's this DLC coming out? June? Or is it July? I know it's June. I don't know if a date's been announced yet. June 28th, it releases. Okay. I don't have the thing set to the right one. What a noob. Okay. So. Wait. Did that? Did that unload that fast? Yeah. Oh, by golly, Georgia did. Plugger, how fast does this trailer unload? <laughs> um. Um. Maybe I don't want to know the answer. <laughs> I don't know if there's something. A hundred thousand per second. Okay, thanks, plugger. <laughs> You're good. We still haven't gotten the tree down. Dang, Tom, I'm coming up to help you. I'm telling you, man. I know, right, Sean? You're not wrong, Sean. You're not wrong, buddy. Oh, goodness me. All right, we need to go grab some fertilizer. We don't have, I don't think we have any solid fertilizer in Homestead, so we'll go grab a load of solid fertilizer and then uh, be able to seed finally. I can't wait. Hopefully it won't take like 18 hours either. It shouldn't, so. And we might need to move some dry corn too. Let's look at that. That's true, Saint Camp, yeah. Very true. Oh, thanks, Plugger. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, 
he slowed it down from 250k for me. Thank you, Plugger. Appreciate it. A little more realistic this way, you know? <laughs> not so not so enhanced realism, you know, a little more right. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's great. That is just great. <laughs> I'm here for it. I think it's funny. And you can put a put a you can put something behind it too, chat. It's got a got a hitch. You gotta hook a couple of them up. Good to go. Like a road train of five million liter trailers? Yes, please. But Matt needed to throw all his wood chips the other day. <laughs> needed a whole dang dang old road train. Uh chat, thank you guys for that hype train. Appreciate y'all. Hit the subs and the bits and stuff. Uh for all right. Uh, oh, this is going to hurt. Ooh, the fertilizer's really going to hurt, isn't it? Uh-huh. Ooh. That's okay. It's a necessary part of the game. We have to have fertilizer to grow our crop. Uh, okay, we don't actually need to move any uh, corn right now. Eventually we'll have to, but there's plenty of room for... Uh, plenty of room for dry corn, so we're good. I think I want to put in a bin. Double trailer park, right? Okay, Carson. Um, I think I want to put in some kind of bin. Um, actually, I know Plugger sent. I think Plugger sent one too. Yeah. Yeah. I say he was talking about it. <laughs> Chat, I don't know if it has enough capacity though. Needs more capacity, plugger. It has 900 million, Trent. 900 million. <laughs> we also have it's these. One it's one buck. We also have these other. Oh, it is a dollar. Oh my god, it is a dollar. <laughs> I didn't even know that. I didn't realize. We have these, the wooden ones that hold uh, 500 million as well. Which are good because they're tiny. They like the footprint's pretty small, you know? So I'm cool with that. Uh does the corn dryer go through propane like no other? No, it's not bad. It's not bad at all, actually. We've hauled maybe four or five loads total, that's it. His plugger. I don't know if the plugger's a Doctor Who fan. I don't know. Oh no. I actually probably fit the uh, doing the dryer in that red shed. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. Maybe. But it would be nice to have like actual storage. I, I don't mind using the uh I don't either, it's just a pain. Like the conveyors and stuff, but you can't AI to them. Or AI out of them. Or they're just kind of a pain, yeah. So That's my issue too, especially with auto drive. Yeah. What is what mod called? Uh, a lot of these mods that I'm going to be showing off today, guys, can be found or will be able to be found. They're not all on there yet. I kind of got got them before they're on the website, but you can find them. We'll be able to find them eventually on the Papa Smurf website uh, in due time. Uh, anything that you see that has... Um, where's it at? Where's that? Where's that? The pl plugger logo up here, the 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 tractor pulling tractor. Anything that has that logo on it, um, maybe not today, but eventually here in the next uh, week or two, I believe, or three weeks, we'll say a couple weeks. Uh, they'll be on the Papa Smurf website. So, any of that stuff that you see with with the logo, um, eventually will be on the Papa Smurf website. Uh, I kind of got stuff early, and this one right here, by the way, I cannot wait. To mess with i just i can't wait a big m cargo i haven't run one of these since like 15 and uh i don't on, think i've ever ran one of these on, i've always wanted on to on duels Trent? on duels on duels with gps with hot pink rims oh <laughs> isn't that just beautiful all right, we're full on fertilizer. Let's go. 
I was trying to kill time waiting to fill up with fertilizer jets. <laughs> oh, man. Nice, Sean. That's not bad, Sean. Nice, nice. Arson, that is rude. Give me a minute. <laughs> Folks, salad, what's going on? How you doing? Folks, salad 11, how you doing today? She's a beaut, Clark. Bert, you're going to run the chopper? Am I? I kind of want to plant corn just to, run, just to run it, you know? <laughs> like, legitimately. <laughs> Uh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going? Stayed. Arson, I am farming. I'm just not doing field work right now. This is still farming. All right. We're hauling the Colombian good good. Okay. Go ahead. Wait. Hauling fertilizer. This is part of farming. Okay. This is not like Saturday where I sat and talked for, you know, 30 minutes before stream. That was fun. <laughs> Sandy Camp, we'll catch you later, buddy. Have a good rest of your day at work. Yeah, I will say, you know, I'm pulling 100,000 liters right now, and I'm assuming the weight has been modified on this trailer because, like, it's pulling like I have an empty truck, which is good. I just missed my turn. I missed my turn, which is good because it allows me to use the cool truck. You know, America. Uh, and it actually, you know, drives like it should. Uh, I was a little worried about pulling around, you know, 100,000 liters, but. Or, you know, this trailer is up to 5 million chat, so. There's that too. But we're good. We're doing it. We're really doing it, chat. We're really doing it. And then we're going to farm. We're going to actually do field work to make Carson happy. Cause it, that's that's why I stream chat, is to make Carson happy. All right, that is the only reason that I stream as much as I do, to make Carson happy. And Carson's not even here for most of it, so yeah. Don't like planting in fields the first time, like IRL bear or like in the farm sim. Cause I could see it IRL. Speaking of like IRL, it seems like everybody's either has their crap planted, cultivating, IRL. or planting. Oh, dude, it's there's so much farm, farm related activities going on right now. It's crazy. <sighs> now that makes sense, IRL, Bert. Yeah, I could see that. I could see it. Especially with like new to you equipment. Eighty-eight feels like ninety-eight. Have fun with that, Sand. I, I, uh, whenever I would like go cut a new yard for the first time, I didn't. I didn't actually the first couple times. I never like. I never enjoyed it. It was always very stressful because yeah, I don't. You don't know. I don't know the yard. I don't know if there's a sewer clean out that's gonna poke out and you know bend a lawnmower blade or a crankshaft or something like. You just don't know. Oh, Bert, you're helping others finish. Oh. Dang. Yeah, I never liked cutting a yard for the first couple times. And you see, you gotta learn the yard, you know? Well, and like, you have your... the next property line over and... Yeah, yeah, that's true too. You gotta deal with neighbors, because sometimes it's like, oh, the old friend used to cut over the line five feet. You better do that too. It's like, well, not part of his property, but okay. Kind of a whole thing. True, Carson, yeah. Truers. Very true. Great, if you want to uh, help, uh, I can use it. <laughs> Lines in the mud holes. Yeah, I could see that, Bert. I could see it, Bert. 
Okay, why does it say? Okay, I am using seed. All right, at first it said I wasn't using any seed. Um, okay. All right. Bone rolling, baby. Oh. By the way, chat, notice I'm going like, you know, 16 miles an hour with a Borgo. I don't think seeding's going to take that long. I mean, I'm still going to be out here a while. Don't get me wrong, but like, it won't be bad, you know? I should get that roller. Oh, the roller's not big enough, though. Never mind. If I had a roller, I could put behind her and just get it done all at once, right? And even with that roller, you can go 3D. Yeah, I don't roll, though. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> not worried about I, rolling. I don't roll anymore. That's not worth it. I mulch now because I got that 16 pro corn head. Oh, yeah. And rolling is just not, not uh. worth it, my book. All right. Yo, Mr. Big Nasty, what's up? How you doing? How's it going? Okay. That's on me. That turn was bad. That was on me. A little aggressive. Carson, what's up? <laughs> you don't have to love the planner? Well, that's, that's good, Bert. Mr. Big Nasty, I am well. I'm enjoying some uh, awesome plugger mods. Everything I'm using right now came from plugger. And it's got capacity and speed and yeah, we're doing it, chat. We're really doing it. These long passes aren't that long now. James, what's up? So you're eating through the wheat or for the fur. Oh, I'm chewing through the fur right now. Yeah. Yeah, I need like manure, a base manure. Is Carson actually here? <laughs> yes, he is, Mr. Big Nasty. For once, he's actually here. He's not a robot right now. Maybe here in a minute, but right now, it's actually him. <laughs> for for once. Yeah, I'm putting down 155 nitrogen right now, Trent. Oh, are you leaving, Carson? Okay. Okay, hey, bye. Mr. Poor Mr. Big Nasty has said hi to you so many times, Carson, and you're not here. Just throwing it out there. Poor guy's just trying to be nice. And I have to explain to him that Carson's a robot. And he's not real. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah, we are pouring the fertilizer to this right now, but that's... That's okay. It holds, you know, 80,000 fertilizer. We'll be okay. Can always go get more, right? Leonard, what's going on, sir? How's work? Welcome in. <laughs> oh, Mr. Big Nasty. Yeah. Maybe he's like Chucky. He runs away. It happens. It happens, Mr. Big Nasty. I'm sorry. I'm surprised Carson's even here. I'm going to be honest. So. I'm surprised he's even here. Is he? Bye. Okay, bye, Leonard. Have a good day. Thanks for saying hi. I'm just going to keep seeding at 16 miles an hour. Don't mind me. Well, 14 right now. But you, you get the gist of it. Yeah. It still blows my mind that this tractor has like over 300 downloads on uh, Papa's on, website. Uh, just, yeah. That blows my mind. Already. Yeah. Oh, okay, Leonard. I got you. I was like, okay, have a good day. Got you, Leonard. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, that's insane that it has so many downloads. To be honest. Absolutely insane. But that's a good thing, right? Not a bad thing. Means a lot of people want it. People like rocket ship tractors, that's all. 
and that can tip very easily. If you hit the right, you know, manure pile, you can you can launch higher than Mr. Jeffrey did. You know, Just saying. Good old Jeffrey, Jeffrey Basil's polar bear. I'm doing well. How are you doing today? Welcome in, sir. How's it going? I just remind me of the uh, giant ramp we built in Erlengrat. What about Erlengrat? Launch tractors and semis. And oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, can you imagine you had this thing coming down and hitting that ramp we had? Oh, my God. It'd end up like on the I other side of the BGA. Uh, somebody, like Leonard. Really? Dang, Leonard. All right, I see how it is. You're not wrong. Installing a sprinkler system in Rust. Nice, polar bear. Nice. Little Einsteins. Yes, Mr. Big Nasty. Absolutely. Never watched that show, but I know the song. That bad. You do watch enough TikTok of that song? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah TikTok. Uh huh. 200 nitrogen right now. Oh my God. I definitely am going to need to fill up with fertilizer. Should I put the other fertilizer cart behind this tramp? Does that if work? It works, yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I haven't seen it yet. That would be hilarious to put that back there as, as capacity. Although it's liquid fertilizer, so I don't know. It should work. How oh, that would work. That would know. be funny. I got mine all ready to go. It's been busy. I just haven't used it yet. Okay. I got some. Do you have this Borgo, though? Uh, you need this one. It's in the Google Drive. I, I uploaded a new folder today. Just saying. Alright, I wasn't going to do Enro's because there's room here, but like, I don't want to leave Skippers, so Enro it is. Just saying. Enro it is. So, uh, Polar Bear, are you trying to grow like greenhouse stuff? Or like stuff in those, uh, like the planter boxes. Is that what you're doing? I usually give up on that. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I'm not sure if the cedar is currently on the website, but uh, it will be eventually. I'm not sure if it currently is or not. Uh, the way it was explained to me is I kind of got like, uh, I don't want to call it early access, but basically early access to these mods. And they'll be posted eventually on the website. So, yeah. One pump only runs six sprinklers. Oh, gotcha. Okay, not yet. There we go. So, not available yet, but it will be eventually. It will be eventually. Yeah. So basically, I get to tease you guys with a bunch of mods that you can't have right now. You're welcome, chat. Smile. <laughs> Smile and wave, boys. <laughs> yeah, so. Eventually, eventually, you guys will get them, okay? Trust me. Eventually. Well, Joe, I'm on Green Valley, Nebraska. And uh, I'm loving this map so far. It's been a lot of fun. We started it Saturday, played for 10 hours, played for a little over four hours last night. And, well, I'm an hour in today, so loving it. Took me almost an hour to get a cedar going, but you know, we're fine. It's fine. <laughs> I had to get fertilizer and, and seed and stuff. So, and, and it takes a minute on a forex map to have to go to bulk uh, supply and get it, bring it back. And, yeah. But actually it'd be faster just to drive the cedar there, park it in the field across the street, and then use a semi truck to go from bulk to the cedar. Probably what I'll do next time. We'll see. Better we get a bunch hauled up to the homestead, but oh, we gotta have money to do that first, so Hoping our dry corn um hoping our dry corn is worth a fair bit. Oh, oh it is. <laughs> yeah. I think especially in June, it's 40,000 of hopper. Whoa. 
Uh, just then, how about the announcement of Kubota today? Um, hold on, let me contain my excitement. Wait for it. I'm so excited for it. Hey. Oh, wait. No, I'm not. Uh, we were talking about it earlier, and I, I kind of wondered if I could get back half my season pass money, uh, to be completely honest. I'm not excited about it at all. No. That, like, no. M8, I mean, the only thing that's good for is put on a mixer wagon, but that's really about it. It only holds, or has 200 horse, max. Yeah, yeah I don't, I don't. I don't know. I, I'm not, I'm not excited for it. And honestly, you know, with, with the tiny tractor, uh, DLC, uh, they did give it to me early and I didn't even download it. Uh, to be completely honest, the Kubota one, I probably won't download early, uh, to be honest with you guys, if they give it to me. Yeah. Portion, I agree. I have been too, to be honest with you. Um, I know not every DLC I'm going to be all excited about and love and everything, but the two so far, just no. Can't Easy there. Or, wow. They should re rename the season pass to Small Tractor Pass, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Justin. Like I said, I'm sure somebody's really excited, you know. I'm sure our buddy Cable peed himself when he saw that it was Kubota. I, I see. Right you know? I saw that this morning. Was like, I, I'm sure he, he peed himself a little, you know. He was very excited about it, but... The cereal will plant everything except for potatoes. Dang, plugger. I buy John Deere, huh? I don't need it. <laughs> I didn't even look at that, uh, to be honest, Bugger. Didn't even look at it. Oh, yeah. It will plant everything except for potatoes. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I just... I don't want to trash, you know, giants or, or anything, but at the same time, it's like... They're... They're, they're swinging and missing a lot here, you know, with the last update, the hot fix that didn't really fix anything. Um, honestly, the Anthony Ferraro, 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 Ferraro whatever DLC, uh, they're, they're, they're swinging and missing a lot. And maybe someday they'll hit a home run again, you know, even like releasing the Borgo Cedar. Obviously, this is a modified Borgo Cedar, but. But when they released the Borgo Cedars, you couldn't even run them in multiplayer because the front wheels would turn in and go all stupid. And it's like, you guys, this is this is something that you all put out, the people that make the game, and they're having these kind of issues. You couldn't even run them in single player with Hired Worker. It would do the same thing. So, uh, we have done Oil Seed Radish. However, uh, Pokesile, they're broken right now. Uh, they do not work like they're intended to. Uh, that's another thing they broke with the last update, actually. Um. But <laughs> crack it. Giants will tell us that we're wrong and they haven't broken anything. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, you're not wrong. Uh, no, it's it's. I think these are valid things, guys. You know. No, Zether, I agree. They did a really good job listening towards the end of 19 uh, and about things for 22. And it's like they've just muted the community since then. I'm going to be completely honest. It's pretty awful. Bert, we'll catch you later. JD got you fired up. Oh. Uh, hey, we got, uh, I see the uh, 200 biddies there. Brian will get to your alert in the next three to six business years, I swear. Uh, but I do appreciate the bits. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Brian, Brian's on vacation today, I think. I, 
I don't know if them publishing the game on their own is having to do with any of this stuff, to be honest. You know, I don't know that that's what's causing the issue. Because the publisher is really just the one that, like, you know, makes the copies of the CDs and, like, they're the ones that get it on Steam. That's what publishers do. You know? So, I don't know that them publishing the game themselves is the problem. Watson, all good here? How you doing? Arson and Brian went for drinks? I think so. I think so. Yeah, it's just... It's kind of a shame and you guys, like, I... I don't know. It's just, it's just kind of a shame, to be honest. I mean, the game is definitely playable. Obviously, I still play it a lot. I'm approaching my first thousand hours here soon. But it's just... It's not going the right way, you know? El Diablo, what's going on, sir? Welcome in. How you doing today? It's just not going the right way. And like I said, I know I'm not going to be happy with every DLC. I've never been happy with every DLC. You know, go back to the 19, that stupid potato DLC. Biggest waste of money on, on 19. Oh, the logging DLC. That was another waste of money on 19. You know, but the Borgo DLC was awesome. You know, so... I know I'm not going to be happy with every DLC. It's just... Swing and miss with the first two, that's for sure. Especially that first one. My god, that thing was garbage. I mean... Unless you're into, you know, the grapes and the olives. But beyond that, that DLC was garbage. Like, just pure garbage. So, it's unfortunate. It really, really, really is unfortunate, to be honest. And, uh, you know, they got to they gotta fix some issues with the game soon. And uh, if they don't, it's going to be bad, you know. It's going to be bad. The game's coming out for Game Pass apparently on console tomorrow on Xbox. Which means though there will be an influx of players. Um, so we'll probably have a lot of console people in here like on Thursday, let's say, asking questions, which is fine. I don't mind it. I'm glad Sean gave me a heads up, actually. So on Thursday, I'm not like, what's going on, you know? I'll know what's going on, which is good. It's always good to be in the know. So, yeah. But it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be interesting. That's for sure. Going to be very very interesting. Rain in eleven hours. Yeah, you know, Trent, they're talking about rain for us for like two days. I think yeah. I heard uh, last night a chance of a uh, severe weather for this rainstorm too. Is it only console game pass, not PC game pass? I actually don't know, Gooser. I, I don't know. You'd have to look it up. Yeah, I wouldn't actually mind a little rain right now, Trent. I'll be honest. I want a little bit of rain, too. <laughs> yeah. I would not mind it. Well, uh, our local pumpkin patch guy is planting today. Yeah. Corn and beans. Uh, Jeff, what DLC, like, what more equipment do we actually need? There's so much. Like, just go look at the John Deere brand. Just start giving us a bunch of random John Deere stuff or random fence stuff or random case stuff. There's so much other equipment they could add. Now, the, say, the argument of, oh. a lot of Deere and case and echo equipment. Yeah, but I know there is the argument of, like, oh, it's another, you know, it's another rake. You know, or, oh, it's another tether, you know, because we've been through that before, too, you know. Burnwin DLC. Yeah. Big storm spurt, huh? Oh, yeah. Big, big, big storm. Oh, they're talking four days in a row. Uh-huh. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I need some dry time. I got I to gotta ridge my pumpkin patch, yo. Better do that Wednesday. I, I got to finish building the ridger first. <laughs> Better do that one day too. And then I got to ridge the pumpkin patch. <laughs> Sounds like you'll be busy one day. Because we want to ridge them and let them kind of mellow and then probably ridge them again and let it mellow and maybe ridge it again and let it mellow before we play it. 
though. <laughs> Mr. Big Nasty. Whoop up. No. There you go. There you go. Oh, Mr. Big Nasty. I swear. <laughs> I like it. Reminds it. me of last night how like those uh, sounds didn't work. Right. Then like today, like the sounds won't work. Wah, 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 wah. Like that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> like last night. Uh, tile plows and drainage. That would be cool. That'd require like the dynamic dynamic ground probably, so self propelled tile pile uh Randy has. So we're not limited. Uh apparently that is in the works, right? Yeah, like the spot spraying technology on other sprayers. That is in the works, right? Yeah. At least one spray right I know of, yeah. yes. Like uh customs forty nine forty. This is your first time seeing the game. So I am currently um, applying fertilizer, yes. And I'm also uh, putting wheat seed in the ground. I'm planting wheat right now. Uh, so this is this is uh, a twofold thing here, obviously. Got seed and fertilizer in the big cart in the back. And uh, yeah, just uh, sowing down some, uh, some uh, wheat right now. I'm actually, I didn't really plan this out, but I'm, I'm actually doing the rotation like the farmers that bought Grapple's Farm do in real life. They have corn, and they would no-till, but of course in farm sim we have to till after corn. But they no-till their wheat right into the corn stalks, right? And then they no-till beans into the wheat stubble. Well, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. <laughs> so we, we're kind of doing like real life farming to where I'm from, basically, which is cool. So, yeah. Yeah, Bert, I don't want to do with my soybean field. I don't want big, big, big storms. You can keep the big storms over there, Bert, okay? I don't want them. No big yeah. storms over here. Just a little rain would People be on nice. your side of the. No, 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 no. You're going to have it. I don't want it. I don't want them. I want them <laughs> on that side of the Illinois. I don't want them on this side of Illinois. Well, they can be in Illinois, just not in Missouri, okay? <laughs> Put up north. Yeah, send them to Bert. <laughs> you finished agricultural academy that's awesome congrats there's an academy for that sure yeah i mean like uh like like tony went to college for some egg stuff you know is he Why driving that overseas? sprayer today by the way oh tony there's no way they were letting him drive a sprayer right I don't know. He, they let him drive the, that truck around the yard. <laughs> Bert's sending all the heavy stuff southeast. Good luck, Trent. <laughs> hey, hey, Bert, can you make sure it uh, takes out his shed? You got a shed you don't want anymore? Yeah. Is it the one with the roof peeled off? Maybe. <laughs> hey, oh, no, you wait. Get, you guys make aren't... sure it comes from the south. He just he... put up a new panel. I say, are you guys getting it fixed or no? Uh, end of May. Oh, okay. End, end of this month. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, That's... make sure it just comes from the south. We just put up a new solar panel. <laughs> Go take that out too? No. You guys get that hooked up? Uh, I, th I believe so, yeah. Okay, cool. What? I am doing well. Welcome in. How's it going? That's funny. That is funny. We are just doing a little uh, wheat seeding right now. By a little, I mean a lot. A lot of wheat seeding currently. You know, this 100 foot seeder at, you know, 15, 60 miles an hour, it gets the job done, y'all. It gets the job done. Just saying. It sure does. Okay. Have a good day. You're going to come in here Bye. just to tell me that you're streaming. Have a good day. Thanks for hanging out. 
Tad, we got the band hammers. I will when I turn around. So rude. Golly, that's so rude. I just can't. I'm sorry, Chad. I can't do that. It's incredibly, incredibly rude, you know? Just to come in here to tell me that you're streaming? No way. Not how you grow on Twitch. The player mod is getting the CD done quickly. It really is, yeah. It really, really is. Getting it done, chat. Between the tractor and the cedar, they're both pluggers. We're getting it done, boys and girls. We sure are. You know, it's funny uh, what just happened there, right? Where he's like lurking, so he, you know, because he's streaming too, right? It's kind of hilarious in a way that like, um, it's kind of hilarious in a way that like people think that works to help them grow on Twitch. You know, people actually think that helps them grow on Twitch. And I'm going to be honest. I think it's hilarious personally, you know? People don't realize that that doesn't work. You know, I'm where I'm at on Twitch. Guess what? I've never done that. I've never gone into somebody else's chat and like tried to buddy up with them and just to drop that I'm a streamer. Uh, I've never gotten a shout out from a bigger streamer or well, really anybody anymore. Um, it's it just, uh, it's not how I grew, you know, slow and organic and just on my own. You know, that's how I grew uh, to what I am today. And I'm not saying that I'm like the best or the biggest streamer. I'm not. But, you know, hard work over nine years of making content. And uh, maybe you can get somewhere, you know? So, you know, doing the follow for follow or shouting out your own channel and somebody else's stream. Like, it's just rude. And it doesn't work. And that hurt. Dang. What's that? Oh. What I sent in Snap earlier and in Farm Sim. <laughs> oh. So, speaking of what I did earlier, I found the max of what you can uh, do at the pump at Casey's. <laughs> yeah, how much is that? $125. Really? Yeah, diesel's not cheap. I say that's like not that much now. <laughs> uh uh. That was only 23 gallons. Dude, we filled up. We filled up one tank on our lawnmower the other day, and it was like 20 bucks. And Dad's like, what? I was like, yeah, Dad, we're going to have to get a different lawnmower, man. This thing is too, like, fuel thirsty. <laughs> it is. It yeah, is. Back a, <laughs> it's thirsty, man. It really is. Uh, I mo well, So we filled it up, and we went to my sister's house. And it, her house is like 10 minutes a moment. Like, they're not even that long. It's it's barely anything, because right now her whole backyard's, like, basically a construction site, so I'm not cutting it. So yeah, I'm cutting, so like, cut front yard, yard and, and a little bit of a side yard, right? And uh, so I just, you know, do my thing. And uh, then I go to the farm, and I cut out the highway, and I cut uh, over half of the farm, I guess. Well, I, no, I did cut most of that twice. But still, it wasn't that many, like, that much time. I used like a, tw a quarter tank of fuel. And I'm just like, how? I guess how? I could have put my card in again so I could actually fill my tank up all the way. Yeah. And I was down at a quarter of a tank. It's ridiculous. And I got the three quarters full. Oh. Cost you $183 yesterday for 34. Wow. Yeah, it's crazy right now, y'all. Hopefully it'll get better, but I don't think it ever will, to be honest. I sure hope so. It's going to keep getting worse, like everything it, else. It hurts. <laughs> yep. Dude, I'm about to, like, make a pedal lawnmower, you know? Like, I have to pedal to cut the grass, you know? <laughs> Let's get the old style. Yeah, I'm joking. The push. I, yeah, an old reel mower? Yeah, no, thank you. I'm pretty sure I would die trying to reel mower the farm. Reel mow the oh, farm. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, even my farm, too. Oh, my God. Dad said, you know, he, when he was a kid, that's all they had, right? It would take him three days to mow the farm. Oh, jeez. Because you just couldn't do it all in one day. 
No. Uh, no, thank you. You may or may not have had a minor altercation with the fuel pump. So who won that altercation? I'm going to guess the fuel pump did. <laughs> well, unless you drove off with the uh, fuel nozzle. Well, that's, that's true. <laughs> then you won. I have seen that. I actually saw that one time where the, the nozzle was missing. And this guy went up to, like, start it. So he, like, goes and he puts his, like, swipes his card. And where the fuel nozzle, or, like, where the fuel hose would attach up top, it just started raining fuel out like a shower. Oh. It wasn't, like, full bore or anything, but it just started, like, running, like, raining fuel. And finally, like, Buddy didn't know what to do. He just stood there, and I think one of the antennas ran out and just, like, pushed the thing down, like, the handle, like he had put the handle back in. Yeah. Bird, I'm sorry. I mean, do you foresee, like, all this stuff to go back down ever? Or, like, you know, uh, shipping, like, logistics uh, to get better? I don't see it happening probably ever, to be honest. Just the world we live in now, you know? I want to be wrong, trust me. You know? it's It's just ridiculous, you know? I mean, maybe, you know, at least in, like, the computer world and, like, the automotive world, when we get, like, chip factories online here in America, that'll help. But good luck finding workers. Because you already can't find workers to do anything. So, you know, you're just going to take people away from other jobs. Well, that's just going to make it worse, you know? So, I, I don't know. Trust me, I ain't the smartest or the brightest bulb in the in the box here, but, you know. I don't know. Maybe in two years. Well, it's already been like two years that we've been dealing with this stuff, so it's uh, it's kind of ridiculous, you know. It really is. Ambush mom, hello. How are you doing today? Like, dad ordered lawnmowers last October, and he's been told he won't see them till twenty three now. Twenty three. Well, it's just like if you want to buy a tractor and a combine, you won't get it till Forget next it. year. Yeah. Crazy. You don't think it'll be ever th under three ounces ever or three dollars ever again? Yeah. It just finally broke four dollars here in Missouri. Really? Yeah, or gas. Gas didn't. or diesel? I guess. Yeah, diesel's been over, but it was like three twenty or four twenty five the other day or something. Hey, last so. year it was three bucks for your gas. Yeah. And not this year. No. Oh no no. So I mean I hope it gets better. But uh yeah, I don't know. I just don't know. Oh no. Four ninety one, holy cow. Crazy. It is 519 for diesel waxies. Yeah. Have I run into supply chain issues importing the Pumbaa crockpots? Yeah, that's why there are none. Um. Yeah, that's why there aren't any. You Definitely. Keep that seven buck diesel. Bam. Wow, wow, wow. I'm fine paying the five dollars instead of seven. But yeah, I know. I don't know. I just I hope it gets better, but I I just don't. I don't know. I don't know. Twelve to fourteen months thing, and you know the sad thing is that F-150 is probably built. It's just sitting in a parking lot somewhere, right? Filling the truck, 380 liters, 100 gallons, holy cow. Holy cow. Yeah, player, uh, Mr. Big Nasty, let's not, you know. Appreciate you not. We all know that it's uh, a lot of what's going on right now in the world can be blamed on, you know, politicians. But uh, let's just not, uh, we don't talk politics here at Puma Plow, so. Let's not go there. I would appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. We don't uh we don't do it. 
I just said we don't talk politics, so we're not going to tolerate it, okay? We're not doing it. Don't do it, chat. We don't, we don't make political comments here, chat. We don't do it. Don't do it. Everything goes up to paychecks, right? Right? Yeah. Thank Could you, Mr. Could my rulers stop? Oh, ah! because the crown's uneven. Uh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Yeah. We know it's a political... I, I mean, everybody knows it's a political issue, but we just don't talk politics here. Because no matter which side you're on, somebody wants to argue, and I don't understand, and this is not me talking politics, but I don't understand when the topic of politics comes up, everybody has to argue about it. That's that's what I don't understand about politics more than anything else. Why people have to argue about it. You know? Politics, religion, and personal finance. We don't talk about personal finance either. That's why, you know, if Trent wants to go buy a $500 Lego set, I'm like, yeah, do it. <laughs> Financially, is that a good idea? No, but you know what? If Trent wants to spend his money on it, good on you. Go, go buy it, you know? Not my decision. And it still hurts the bank account. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? Like, it's your money. If you want to spend it on, you know, a $500 Lego set, have fun. Does it hurt me or hurt anybody else at the end of the day what Trent spends his money on? No. <laughs> it's Trent's money. He can spend it on what he wants. Trent wants to go get, buy a $100 wig and wear it when he mows his grass. Have fun. I don't think he would do that, but you know. <laughs> I sure hope not. <laughs> that just sounds like torture. It'd probably be hot. Yeah, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, uh... I don't like Especially people. The Illinois, uh -huh. yeah. I don't like people telling people like what they should and shouldn't be doing with their money. It's their money. They can do what they want with it. Yeah. Trent is a redhead. Hey yo. Uh, I'm a blonde. <laughs> hey yo. Right, you might you might get people stopping and hollering at you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh goodness no it is your money use it when you need it use it for what you want it for yeah I always tell the story when this comes up that uh, many many moons ago uh, my one brother came to town and he brought his uh, fiance at the time and we went to a cardinal game and I remember, like, I knew about this game for a while that he was coming to town to go to this game. And so I had been saving up my money because, you know, money wasn't a thing I had a lot of as, uh, as growing up and stuff, right? And so I had been saving up my pennies, grass-cutting money, whatnot. And uh, I uh, remember being ex very excited to, like, go and buy, like, a big soda and, like, you know, some ballpark nachos because that, that's a baseball game to me. You got to get those nachos, you know? Awesome, Bert. Glad to hear it. Um, so I remember going and then like she wouldn't let me like pay for my own food. And I just remember being like kind of angry that she wouldn't let me like buy my own food. I mean, I'm grateful that she's going to buy it for me. But at the same time, like I worked my butt off and I had been planning to like buy these nachos for a while, you know. And I just remember thinking like, God, how, what gives you the right to tell me what I can and can't do with my money? You're not like my parent. Us off. Yeah, sounds like my uncle. And to be honest, my parents never even told me really what I should and shouldn't do with my money. It's whatever you want, it's your money. You know? Uh, thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome on in. How's it going? Wow, Trent. Wow. Your DM. Yeah. I assume you're referring to somebody that we know, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not as bad as Farmer Nick's DMs, but still, you know. <laughs> Men are great at occasionally. Farmer Nick's are just filthy, honestly. <laughs> I was, These are dingers. I was recently talking to somebody about like that and about how when I just go Farmer Nick inappropriate, <laughs> it's usually because I got a DM that is filthy. <laughs> so, yeah. 
And if now I'm curious enough, he'll actually DM it to me or yeah, snap it. And not like a little it's bit either, great. like like bad. Yeah, it's bad. <laughs> Usually it's really bad. But funny at the same time. Birdie's not talking about you. Don't worry, buddy. He's referring to a uh, certain uh, Regatoni. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I think kind of kind of an inside joke there. So, yeah. No, not filthy. Being filthy, Farmer Neck is filthy. Like the stuff he DMs me. Filthy's not here right now. He does come in here sometimes, though, uh, Mr. Bay Nasty. But he's not currently here, no. Not that I'm aware of. You never know. He could be. He's probably up on a tower somewhere. That's what he does. You know, climbs, climbs radio towers and cell towers and stuff. Some of the pictures he's posted uh, in Ghost Discord are absolutely insane, by the way. Him, like, way up on a tower on the top of a mountain or something. It's like, what? Crazy. Absolutely insane. Chat, why am I seeing these like stripes? Is that from the mulch? Oh, oh. yeah. Maybe. Uh, I don't know what that is. I don't. It's like don't different know. levels of nitrogen. Maybe it'll fix itself. Oh, not too worried about it. Not too worried about it. Just weird looking. <laughs> wow, Mr. B. Nasty. Where do you buy the propane? Uh, it's called Strickland Propane. You go down there and talk to my boy, Hank. All right, Bert, be safe going down the road. Uh, no, it's called uh, Bucks Play. Uh, it's over here. Just on the side of seven. Uh, it's actually this north uh, east one. Once you go in there, is the propane. But ask for ask for Hank; he'll hook you up. Give you a discount. All right. Smoking pork chops with fried taters. That sounds good. I have no idea what I'm making for dinner tonight. I need to make dinner tonight. Last night was leftovers. Family did a good job, like cleaning up the leftovers. So I, I have to reward them with a with a fresh cooked meal. Maybe breakfast. Food. I know there's some bagels in my kitchen. They're probably gonna go moldy here soon. So better eat those up, right? Just saying. Pizzas. Huh? Any pizzas? No, make like sausage, egg, and cheese sandwiches. Chat with him when you get there. Awesome. Oh boy, Hank. Uh, that would be funny if they called it Strickland Propane. That would be rather amusing. But yeah, I do plan on watching the uh, the card, not Cardinal, the the hockey game tonight. Tonight's game one. So is that seven. I think it's on at like the eight thirty or whatever again. I think it's like. Uh, I'll just have to postpone watching some shows with dad till Wednesday night. Which is fine because I rather watch the shows with dad on the, like through the Paramount app. Um, because they look better anyway. Than watching them through our cable. <laughs> it's gonna be uh it's gonna be a good game. I'm I'm ready for it. And I know there's there's some Avs fans in here at Ambush Mom, and that's fine. Well, wow, wow, wow. What do you call a sleeping bull? Bulldozer. Skiing, I, I like it. All right, Mr. Be Nasty. I see the jokes. Uh, 8.30 tonight, Trent, by the way. 8.30 and 8.30 on Thursday as well. 
and then I probably won't be able to watch the Saturday game because it's Saturday at 7 which I mean I can watch it I'll just be streaming and then Monday at uh, 8.30 again so they're getting those late uh, they're getting those late time slots which sucks but I don't, I don't mind it too much that gives me plenty of time to watch probably like the first FBI with Dad tonight and then get back out here to fire up some blue Hockey. Saying, looking forward to it. Hopefully, Carson's here with his uh, soundboard. <laughs> yeah. And the the timing too. Never buy your hay from Amazon. Huh? What? Sean, what? It's trying his FBI news, do you know? Yeah, they're new tonight. Okay, they are new. I'll be watching those and the, the game tonight. Sean. Sean what? Sean. Son, I might need to get up and walk away after that one, buddy. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow, Sean, just I didn't see it coming, I'm gonna be honest. I thought you were being serious. <laughs> I really thought you were being serious, John. Uh oh. What? Wait, Hank's gonna bump up my prices because I didn't keep the discount a secret. Dang it. Dang it, Hank. Tell me about the Dang discount, it, Bobby. Dang it, Bobby. You know what? I'll just take Hank a Baha blast later. And he'll be fine. Okay? Oh, oh, oh. Hank will be just fine. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Consider the average weight is 52 tons. What? Average weight of what? Y'all got me like more confused than a $3 bill right now. Okay. I'm so lost in this chat room right now. Just so everybody's aware. Yeah, go Blues! I'm gonna go mow the uh, uncle's yard. <laughs> have fun with that, Trent. Sure I'll you try will. to. At least I'll have music. Well, that's good, right? Hey, bye. Right, put, put the stream on my phone and put the phone on the, your foot, the footrest. <laughs> it's magnetic. You do have, I say you have that magnet, right? Yeah, it's kind of nice, actually. I just put my phone in my shirt pocket when I mow. I used to big do shirt that pocket until guy. I got that, that case. That is kind of cool with the magnet, though, yeah. I can't lie. But I'll be back later. Have fun. Yep. Uh, Steven, what's up, sir? How you doing today? Welcome in. I swear I'm almost done harvest. Or not. What am I doing? Planting. I got one more field, y'all. But it's a little tiny guy. Done in a jiffy, okay? Field 20. Only take me a jiffy to get there and knock it out. I thought I was going to have to fill up the seed or the fertilizer by now. But uh, as you can tell, we're at 50%, so we are rocking. We will not have to fill up uh, to get done. This added capacity sure is nice. Added speed sure is nice. We get two or three of these things rocking eventually on this map. Oh, be able to cover some ground. This is sweet rig, you like it? It's pretty nice, isn't it? It's a pretty nice uh, rig we got going here. All modded, all by plugger. Uh, all of it will be available eventually on Papa Smurf's website as well. It's not currently. The tractor is, the cedar's not. But it's nice. 
being able to seed along at 16 miles an hour with a lot of seed and a lot of fertilizer capacity. 